Hey guys, this is Jack with Kapwing. Zooming in can be a great tool in your videos to build suspense, focus in on a subject, and also just to liven up an otherwise stagnant shot. You may describe this as moving zoom, slow zoom, gradual zoom, Ken Burns, or probably a million other names, but the effect is unmistakable. And we just added this effect on Kapwing, our online video editor, and have made it easier than ever to do this because you guys asked for this so much and we had to provide. So today I'm gonna to show you guys how to do this to liven up your videos and I hope that you guys enjoy. Okay, hi guys. So the first thing you wanna do is go to kapwing.com. You can click the first link in the description and it'll take you here. And then you're just going to want to sign in. It's completely free. It'll just make it so that when you export your video, you don't have a watermark and you can sign in with any of these options. So once you're in your workspace, you will create new content. And then I'm just going to use one of the videos I already have on a media library, but if this is your first time using Kapwing, then you can upload your footage by dragging in files here or by pasting in the link. Okay, so getting the moving zoom or Ken Burns or whatever you want to call it is super, super easy, super simple here. So the first thing you wanna do is find the part of the video that you want this to happen in. So let's say that I only want it to be in this first seven seconds. Um, then I will split this clip using the split button or the S button on your keyboard. Um, and then I, when I apply the moving zoom, I can apply it just to this clip so it doesn't stretch out for the entire uh, video. So all I have to do is highlight this clip and then go over here to the animate tab on the right. Click moving zoom down at the bottom here. Um, and then you are able to play around with how much you want it to zoom. So if you want it to zoom more, you want the end screen to be much smaller and you can move this wherever you want. It can end wherever you want. If you want it to be a more subtle zoom, you can pull this out and it'll be a much slower and smaller zoom. It, also, if you want it to start close up, then you can make the start video um, very close and zoomed in and you can make the end video zoomed out. So for instance, I could start really zoomed in and then it will zoom out end after this clip is over and it should go back to the normal layout. Yep, so it pops back to the normal amount of zoom that you recorded in. And then I can do this again. I'll click the split button and a split button again. And maybe I wanna do a really fast one this time. I'll highlight that clip, go over to animate, moving zoom, and then I'll make this a really fast one. Um, maybe in something in the background that I'm trying to highlight that's funny or something like that. And yeah, that's about it. It's super simple. You just have to go to animate, moving zoom, and then play around with the start and ends. If you don't want it to move and you want a quick zoom, then you can um, just highlight another portion of the video by splitting the clip, um, highlighting it, and then you can also just go to the edit tab and click the crop button and crop in, and then that'll make it a much quicker and more abrupt zoom. So as you can see, this one cuts in right here um, instead of zooming in. So that's another option. So when you're happy with the video, you can just go ahead and click export video. So your video will process and then it will show you the preview of the video. So if you're happy with this, then you can go ahead and click the download button right here. It will save to your computer and you will be ready to post. All right, guys, that's it. Make sure to subscribe to the channel to join an online community of modern creators. Also check out our Discord so you can keep up with other Kapwingers and the Kapwing staff. And I'll see you guys in the next one.